Uh, seems like a lot. Um, we've played some good teams over being on the road. Like I think, you know, those those numbers, you know, they're conceivable. They could happen in those games. Some of them are, are um, you know, uh, they're tough games. Like all the way through, like the Nashville's overtime and stuff like that. So there's some tough games. Last game where they held Colorado to just ten shots, and uh, I did how see you, that. You, how how can you avoid being another victim of their stifling defense? Uh, they just play hard. Like the only thing you can do out is go out every shift, and uh, um, you got to work at it. So uh, they're just a real good team. Like they always play their best this time of year, and and uh, and we know that, and we know we're going to have to have a great game to have a chance. You had 42 shots when you faced them the last time. That was a bit of a, a breakthrough, um, just in terms of being able to get some pressure. What do you take from that that you hope to replicate tonight? Well, that was a big game for us going into their building. Um, you know, we knew we we needed that game. We knew we had to play well, and, and we found a way to play well. So it might give us a little confidence, but every game is just a new game. It doesn't matter really what happened last game. And, and if you look at how they're playing now, they're playing better again. So... Um, you know, that won't help us tonight. We just have to make sure we're ready tonight. This time of year is a new experience for some of your younger players, Willie. What do you tell guys like Horvat or even Vey, or do you lean on your veteran group to maybe help them through this time of year? That's a, maybe a little bit more of a mental struggle than the physical part of the game? Yeah. You do rely on your veteran players. They're always a key at this time of year. Um, not only their game, but I think what they show, they, they, they can give confidence to the younger guys. And I think a lot of the game's about confidence. So, um, you know, I think that uh, uh, for the new players, it's a, it's a great time of year, though. Like, a lot of times you can make up for it with your energy and, and your, your youth. I think you just can be quicker. So I think there's a little bit of trade-off both ways. Face-off has been a bit of a problem. Is, is there anything else you can do as a coach, or these are your centermen and it's just the way it is? These are our centermen for sure. Um, you know, I think they all know it when, when we talk about it, and uh, we've worked at it. But, uh, uh, you know, the other guys are... Every every player has a different strengths and weaknesses, and you know, uh, Alley's got some good guys. Like they they're they're heavy in the circle, so um, we know that we'll have to come in there and battle hard, and uh, um, our wingers have to be ready to help out in any loose pucks. Willie, what uh, can you give us any update on Richardson and Cassian? Are they skating? <laughs> no, I can't. Like they're uh, they've been off for a bit, and it, like it's I'm not I, I don't want to, I'm not going to talk about injuries too much, but that, those are certainly. You know, this is probably the last time we'll talk about. Those are certain injuries that we didn't expect. Like, I expected Richardson to play. I thought he might play the game after he got hurt. So that that injury has been a long injury that we didn't expect. Um, you know, I think the Cassian one. You know, every day you think it might be better, and it just hasn't come along like we hoped. So um, I won't address it. You know, after this. But anyways, they they are injuries that we we expected to be back sooner and. Uh, uh, they turned out to be a little bit later than we thought.